नमस्कार दोस्तों आप स्वागत है हमारे यूट्यूब चैनल में आज आप बात करी सी सी सिक्स जीरो सिक्स एम सी क्यू बी ए सैमेस्टर सिक्स इंग्लिश जेन विषय है मेन एना चैप्टर वन एट के सी सी सिक्स जीरो सिक्स इंट्रोडक्शन टू रोमन टेक एज एंड विक्टोरियन तो यह पहले क्वेश्चन जुशु रोमन टेक एज सत्तर सौ अठाणु थी अठार सौ त्रीस सुधी Theodor Watts didn't change the title The Renaissance of Wonder to the Womb so to the Romantic Age who gave the slogan back to nature most important question to wordsworth next trija number no question the old french word romance from which the word romantic was derived means a group of tribe from latin next question the french revolution took place in In which in which year? So in seventeen eighty nine. Who wrote the four ages of poetry? So who wrote Peacock? Next question. Tales from Shakespeare come out in the year of eighteen seven. Which period is known as the Romantic Age in English literature? So the answer is seventeen ninety eight to eighteen thirty. Next question. Who says the romantic movement was the expression of individual genius rather than the established rules? The answer is W. J. Long. Next question. Who says the romantic character in art consists in the addition of strangeness to the beauty? Most important question. Walter Peter. Next question. The romantic age is also known as in literature. So the Romantic Age was also known as liberalism. Next question: Who said that nature is the best teacher? So it is said by Wordsworth. Most important question: Who said that proper study of mankind is man? So who said that? The Alexander Pope. Next question: Romantic poets often found their subjects from. So the answer is Middle Ages. Next question. Which form of poetry was popular during Romantic period? So the important question is, answer is lyrical. Next question, lyrical ballad was published in which year? Most important question, published in seventeen ninety eight. Who is regarded as the prince of English essayist? Most important question, Charles Lamb. Who wrote the decline and the fall of the Roman Empire? So who wrote Edward Gibbon? Edward Gibbon wrote the decline and the fall of Romantic, sorry, Roman Empire. Edward Gibbon. Next question. Who wrote Aids to Reflection? So it is written by Coleridge. Most important question. How many poems were there in the first edition of Lyrical Ballad? So how many poems? Twenty three poems. Wordsworth Mag Magnum Opus is generally considered to be so the answer is the prologue. Next question. Wordsworth was poet laureate from which year to which year? From eighteen forty to eighteen fifty. This foundation work of the Romantic period was published by William Wordsworth and Samuel Taylor Coleridge. So the foundation work of Romantic period was the lyrical ballad, a thing of beauty in a joy forever. Its loveliness increases. Are the opening words of which landmark poem by John Keats? So the answer is Andy Mion. Andy Mion. Next question. Which of the Romantics work? As an agricultural laborer, as a child. So the correct answer is John Clare. Next question: Which one of these authors was not among the so-called Lake poets? So John Polidori. So Polidori was not Lake poet. Next question: Who applied the term romantic to the literary period dating from seventeen eighty five to eighteen thirty? So it was applied the term the Sanitic school 
ऑफ बायरन पर्शी शेली बीपी शेली एंड देयर फॉलोअर्स नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन विच सॉर्ट्स ऑफ पॉलिटिकल रिफॉर्म टूक प्लेस ड्यूरिंग द रोमेंटिक पीरियड सो द आंसर इज ए एंड डी ओनली मीन्स significant labor and voting reform would have to wait for the victorian era and later next question which two writers can be described as writing historical novels so two writers can be described writing historical novel walter scott and maria edgeworth next question the romantic writer used ilia for pseudonym the he was unusual among the romantics in his preference for the city over the country so who was charles lamb next question we know him best as a writer of supernatural poetry but in his own day he was better known for his religious prose so he was as to coleridge samuel taylor coleridge next question who defines romanticism as the renaissance of wonder so it is defined by what's done to next question who among following was almost a classicist in an age of romanticist so the answer is maria edgeworth next question who gave 11000 396 definitions of romanticism so most important question f l lucas next question which romantic poet coined the famous phrase sports of time so he was s t coleridge next question who define poetry as spontaneous overflow of powerful feelings emotions recollected in tranquility so who define William Wordsworth next question Victorian age these are the question related to Victorian age the period from 1830 to 1890 is known as Victorian age next question which rulers reign marks the approximate beginning and end of the Victorian era so the answer is queen victoria which city became the perceived center of western civilization by the middle of the 19th century so the answer is london by 1890 what percentage of the earth's population was subject to queen victoria so the answer is 25 percentage what did thomas carly mean by close thy byron open the gate so the answer is abandoned the introspection of the romantics and turn to the higher moral purpose found in goethe next question what does the phrase white man's burden coins by kipling refer to answer a moral responsibility to bring civilization and christianity to the people of the world next question which of the following authors promoted vision versions of socialism so the answer is william morris karl marx and john ruskin so all of the above next question queen victoria came into the throne of england in in 1837 victorian age is an age of so is an age of frozen novel who has written in memoriam it was written by tennyson next question who wrote unto this last john ruskin most important question this victorian novelist wrote many poems to his call collection of poets poems wessex poems and other vessel verses was published in 1898 by thomas hardy next question who wrote the ring and the book most important question the ring and the book by robert browning next question The Ring and the Book is a series of dramatic monologue. So Robert Browning has written The Ring and the Book and it was series of ram- dramatic monologues. Next question. Who is known as the original novelist? So who is known as the original novelist? Thomas Hardy. Next question. The heroes as poet is. The heroes as poet is both. 
B and she means Shakespeare and Dante. Next question. What is the subtitle of the novel Vanity Fair? Most important question. Pen and pencil sketches of English society. Vanity Fair. Next question. Who is the heroines of the novel Vanity Fair? So both A and B means Beck Sharp and Amelia. Next question. To whom did the Reform Bill of 1832 extend the vote on parliamentary representation? So the answer is the lower middle classes. The lower middle classes. Next question. Which event did not occur as part of the rise of the British Empire under Queen Victoria? So the answer is in 18... Sorry, the answer is to save costs and maximize profit. The day to the government of India was transferred from Parliament to the private East India Company. Next question. Who wrote on the origin of spices? So, origin, origin of species written by Charles Darwin. Next question. David Copperfield was first published in David Copperfield was first published in 1850. On origin of species was first published in 1859. Who wrote Dover Beach? Dover Beach was written by Matthew Arnold. Next question. Which term became the spirit of Victorian age? So, Victorian compromise. Next question. By 1890, what percentage of the Earth's population was subject to Queen Victoria? So, it was 25%. Next question. To whom did the Reform Bill of 1832 extend the vote on parliamentary representations? The lower middle classes. Next question. What best describes the subject of most Victorian novels? So, A and D means the representation of large and comprehensive social world in realistic detail. N, the last one, the attempt of protagonist to define his or her place in society. Next question. What to Nightingale focused on how a pleasures are fleeting and life cannot continue forever. Next question. Which of the following would probably not occur in a William Wordsworth poem? So the answer is mockery of political figures. Next question. Queen Victoria succeeded to the throne of England after William for Next question. The golden jubilee of Queen Victoria reign was celebrated in 1887. Next question. Queen Victoria became the Empress of India in 1877. Next question. Which revolution had a great impact on the Victorian life? So it was Industrial Revolution. Next question. Questions related to Oxford Movement. Oxford Movement is also known as Huge Church Movement. Sorry, High Church Movement and Tracted in movement. Most important question. Oxford movement is century movement. It's of 19th century movement. Oxford movement sought a renewal of Roman Catholic. Who was were the leaders of Oxford movement? All of the above. John Cable, John Henry Newman and Edward Posey. Next question. The ideas of the movement were published in blank which were written by Newman tracks of the time which was written by Henry Newman next question Cardinal Newman's autobiography is Apologia Fro Vita Sua next question who wrote the Christian year the Christian year written by John Cable next question Edward Percy was the professor of at the University of Oxford Hebrew, Hebrew University. Next question. Who said that Oxford movement was out of the very roots of its being a rational movement, almost rationalist movement? G.K. Cheston. The Oxford movement derived much inspiration from the answer is Middle Ages. Next question.
द ऑक्सफर्ड मूवमेंट वॉज बेसिकली ए रिलीजियस मूवमेंट नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन द ऑक्सफर्ड मूवमेंट वॉज स्टार्टेड बाय द स्कॉलर ऑफ द ऑक्सफर्ड यूनिवर्सिटी नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन What was the common amongst Dicci Rossetti, Krishna Rossetti, Morris and Swinburne? So they all belong to the pre-Raphaelite school. Next question. Who was the leader of the pre-Raphaelite group of artists in England? D.G. Rossetti. Next question. Who is the author of the blessed damsel? D.G. Rossetti. Next question. Who is the author of Aura Lane. So the answer is Elizabeth Barrett Browning. Elizabeth Browning. Next question. What is the common amongst Cardinal Newman, John Cable, had Henry Newman, and Stanley? So the answer is they all belong to the Oxford movement. Next question. What is meant by Wessex? The origin in which Hardy's novels are set. Next question. The region. That is known as VSX novel. Next question. George Eliot was the pen name of Marion Evans. Marion Evans. Next question. Charles Dickens left one novel unfinished. Which is it? It was Edwin Drought. Next question. Tennyson was. Tennyson was appointed poet laureate after William Wordsworth. Next question. What is the other name of Oxford movement? Tractarian movement. Who is the pioneer of Oxford movement? John Henry Newman. Next question. Unit number two. The world is too much with us. Author William Wordsworth. Most important question. Published in 1807. Poems in two volumes. Form Jenner Sonnet. Who wrote the religious ballad William Wordsworth and S.T. Coleridge? Wordsworth's lifespan 1770-1850 The poet feels that we lay waste of power because we are too materialistic. Next, the world is too much with us is Petrarchian sonnet because it has an octave and sustain. Which kind of natural images are presented in the poem The Sea, The Moon, The Wine? What is the mean by sordid moon? Means a materialistic gift that become the curse. What kind of glimpses would the mint or the poet live to have? Glimpse of nature. Next. The poet is the blank as the worship of the nature pagan. What is the rhyme scheme of the sonnet? A B B A A B B A C D E C D E. Next question. The world is too much with us. An attack on materialism. Next question. Who are gods mentioned in the poem? Proteus and Triton. Next question. What does the poem compares the wind to? So the answer is sleeping flowers. Next question. According to persona, we are out of answer is tune. Next question. Wordsworth was the poet laureate from 1843 to 1850. What type of poem? The world is too much with us. So it was sonnet. Next question. Where people have sold their hearts to the god of wealth. Next question. What is the main theme of the sonnet? So, poets love for the calm and quiet beauty of nature. Next question. In which religion is like the poet in this sonnet? So the answer is Krishna. How many lines in this sonnet? So the answer is 14 lines. In which model the sonnet is written? So in Petrarchian model. What is the meter of the poem? Meter of the poem. So it was iambic pentameter. Next question. The world is too much with us is a Petrarchian sonnet because it has octave and sestet. Next question. The poet feels that we lay waste our powers because we are too materialistic. In this sonnet, first headlines, the poet discuss the problem. 
नेक्स्ट इन दिस सोनेट लास्ट सिक्स लाइन्स द पोएट डिस्कस द सॉल्यूशन नेक्स्ट हैव ग्लिम्पिस इज दैट वुड मेक मिलेस फॉर लॉन मीन्स द पोएट विशेज टू सी नेचुरल साइड्स दैट वुड चीयर है अब नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन द पोएट एडवोकेट्स हिम लव फॉर सो द आंसर इज पैगनीजम नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन वो मेक पोएट लेस लॉनली सो आंसर इज नेचर वो नेवर लाइक द स्टॉनी आस्पेक्ट ऑफ नेचर सो द आंसर इज पोएट वर्ड्स वर्थ विच लाइन डज द स्पीकर सजेस्ट वे आर कंसिडर विथ मटेरियल गेटिंग एंड स्पेंडिंग वे ले वेस्ट आवर पावर्स नेक्स्ट ले वेस्ट देयर स्पिरिचुअल पावर इन गेटिंग एंड स्पेंडिंग द लाइन फ्रॉम विच पोएम सो इट वॉज फ्रॉम द वर्ल्ड इज टू मच विटर्स वॉट इज द सेंट्रल पर्पज ऑफ दिस सोन एंड टू लिंक द रिलेशनशिप दैट नेचर हैज विद द इवेंचुअल डिगार्डेशन ऑफ ह्यूमन काइंड नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन वट डज द स्टोरी फोकस इज ऑन द स्टोरी फोकस इज ऑन टेकिंग लाइफ फॉर ग्रांटेड नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन वॉट इज द टाइटल ऑफ द पोएम द वर्ल्ड इज टू मच विथ आस नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन टाइटल फॉर अस सॉरी द स्पीकर विशेष टू हैव वट टाइप ऑफ बैकग्राउंड अ पेगन नेक्स्ट वट डज द सी गिव टू द मून हर बॉसम नेक्स्ट चैप्टर ओ टू स्काई लार्क विच इज रिटर्न बाय पी बी शैली परशी बेली शैली पब्लिश इन एटीन ट्वेंटी वन पी स्टैंड फॉर इन पी बी शैली परसी फ्रॉम लिरिक मीन्स एन फॉर्म क्यू है लिरिक है शैलीस लाइफ स्पन इज सेवनटीन नाइंटी टू टू एटीन ट्वेंटी टू शैली वॉज अ स्टूडेंट ऑफ वर्ड स्कूल इन विच he was expelled from oxford shelley's wife is best known for which work so answer is frankly stain next question in his poem ode to skylark shelley wrote the skylark as a spirit in his poem ode to skylark shelley compares to the skylarks to a globe worm a princess in a tower and a poet next question how many lines are there in each stanzas in stanzas of the poet poem five lines which university expel for she belly shelly oxford the writing of which pamphlet caused for she belly shelly's expulsion so the answer is the necessity of atheism next question how did percy be by c shelly die so by drowned shelly's death was caused by drowning next question our sweetest songs are those that tell of saddest thought next question what is the length of uh, length of skylar so it was 18 cm next question how long can a skylar roughly live discuss 9 years What does the speaker appear to envy over the skylark? The freedom of word has. During the poem, Shelley begins using what literary device for five straight sentences? So it was of metaphor. What is the speaker's request to the skylark in the last stanza? To be taught. Next question. How does the speaker compares the skylark to a high-born maiden? so the answer is the maiden gives her heart as a skylark signs with their heart next question beside to a skylark what is another greatly famous poem from the 19th century or to nightingale next question shelley wrote with what artistic drive so the answer is impulse the author of to a skylark died by drowning who was he he was pb shelley और सी वाई सी सैली नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन वो रॉट आवर स्वीटेस्ट सॉन्ग्स आर दोज दैट टेल ऑफ सैडेस्ट थॉट्स सो द आंसर इज पी बी शैली इफ विंटर कम्स कैन स्प्रिंग बी फार बिहाइंड विच पोएम ऑफ शैली एंड्स विथ दिस लाइन सो द आंसर इज आउट टू द वेस्ट विंग नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन 
who said poet are the un knowledgeable legislator of the world so the answer is maybe shelley what does shelley address the skylark in his poem o to skylark blitz spirit next question our sweetest songs are those that tell of saddest thought the line occurs in the poem to the skylark most important question next question the last try together author robert browning published in 1850 1855 the last night together browning is famous for dramatic monologue what is the form of the last night together dramatic monologue browning's life span 1812 to 1889 the last night together is divided into 10 stanzas how many lines are there in each stanza so 10 stanza next question who is the wife of robert browning elizabeth barrett next question in which book the poem the last right together published men and women what is the major theme of the poem love and loss what is the tone of the poem sad and op- optical next question in seven stanzas the speaker compares the lover to a great poet next question the last right together is dramatic monologue form of dramatic manner dover beach next poem dover beach was written by matthew arnold published in 1867 arnold belongs to victorian age what is the form of dover beach lyrics arnold's life span is 1820 to 1888 dover beach is divided into four stanzas how many lines are there in dover beach 37 What literary devices are used in the over beach imaginary simile and metaphor Dover beach is the metaphor for loss of faith and darkness of humanity What inspired Matthew Arnold to write Dover beach his honeymoon and Dover beach What said poetry is criticism of life who said Matthew Arnold Which poem of Arnold shows most the Victorian loss of religion faith Dover Beach next poem Oswello or solo flying south Author Alfred Tennyson Tennyson published in 1847 Tennyson is the respect representative of the poet of Victorian age what is the form of Oswello solo flying south so lyrics Tennyson's life span is 189 to 1892 Oswello solo flying south is one of the songs of the princess The name of the princess is Ida. Oswalo solo flying south in the canto of the princess for Oswalo flying south is written in blank verse. The princess Ida lives in the north part. Which bird is mentioned in the poem Swallow? A Tennyson's become the poet laureate in which year 1850 after the death of Wordsworth. Tennyson's in memoriam was written in the memory of Arthur Henry Hallam next unit the hard times hard times is novel written by charles dickens full title hard times for he, these times a full title can be asked in the examination publication 1854 in london type of work novel genre victorian novel realistic novel satire and dystopia dystopia next question What is the name of Sissy's father dog Mary Legs so Mary Legs next what is the main principles of Mr Grand Gill's philosophy so it was fact Mrs Pegler is the mother of which character Bounderby next question who robs the bank Tom what is the common name for the poor cocktown factory workers so the answer is hands Sissy believes her father abandoned her for what reason her own best interest which of the following characters dies during the course of this novel which members of the grandin family dies near the middle of the story so the mrs great green next question who is kidder minister so the answer is a circus workers worker would dress up as cupid next question What does Rachel find uh, that leads her to believe believes Stephen has been murdered 
his uh, his hat abandoned in the field next question how does stephen die a fall into old hell raft next question who runs the circus slary how about how much money is stolen from the bank 150 pounds next question which character is the member of parliament grand gate next question what is bounderbow's son's name bounder bury son's name so son's name was bounder bury has no son in which city does most of the novel take place so the cock town from what does mrs farset imagine lucia falling a staircase next question who is the first character to speak in the novel so the answer is great green next question why is stephen unable to marry rachel he is already married next question how do the poor of cock town attempt to improve their condition so the answer is by forming a union next question what is the name of mrs farset's aristocratic relative so the answer is lady scadlers next question what does grand grid hope to tom will be able to do after stephen's death so the answer is escape england next question what is blizzard's defining characteristics so his pale skin next question what does luisa flee after her house declaration of law so the answer is her father's house what are cc's father's first words after he returns to his daughter so the answer is he never returns next question what motivates hearth house to become one of grand gates political disciplines boredom boredom next question josia is the character of his novel hard times charles dickens was born in 1812 charles dickens novel hard times is partly which type of novel hardly partly autobiography in hard times grand gates and bounderbury represent the answer is b the worst evils of capitalist life next question in hard times luisa is the daughter of thomas grand gate most ambiguous who is tom son of grand green where is the story set in cock town at the beginning of the story mr grand gate calls the pupils by numbers what number is cc ju it was of 20 what was the grand green's family home called stone lodge next question what are the names of mr grand green's children luisa and tom what position is mr grand green campaigning for so the answer is member of parliament what does mr grand green say is the most important philosophy the answer is facts what does luisa marry whom does sorry so the answer is mr bounderby where does bizar end up working when he wo- uh, when he grows up so the answer is bounder buddies bank next question who does luisa think that she wo- she has fallen in love with while she is married to mr bounder buddy mr hearthouse next question who has distinctive lips lips so the answer is mr slary at the beginning of the story what did mr grandge ask cc jup and bizarre to give the definition of a horse next question who was the woman who was always going to the bank window so the answer is mr bounderby's mother how does stephen blackpool die so the answer is he falls down a disused mine shaft next question what is mr bounderby's first name josia who stole from mr bounderby's bank tom great green next question what is the name of mr bounderby's housekeeper maid so the answer is mrs sparsit where does tom hide before he flees the country so the answer is circus 
What name was given to the workers at Bounder Beast Factory? The hands. What is Sissy's real name? Answer is Cecilia. What offers the correct definition of a horse? Bizar. What is the model of uh, Mr. Grandgreen School? The factory. Where does Mrs. Grandgreen live? Stone Lodge. Who is not one of the Grandgreen children? Charles. At the beginning of the hard times, who is Cecily's length guardian? Her father. What is Signor? Jeeps. True profession. So the answer is circle performance. What is the name of the public house where Sissy lives? Pegasus Arm. Cocktown uh, is, uh, is a literary representation of which major British city? So the an answer is Manchester. What does Mr. Bounderby think that the poor want? Turtle soap and a golden spoon. Turtle soup and golden spoon. What killed Mrs. Parsett's husband? So the answer is French liquor. Why does the mysterious old woman come to cock down each year to see the fine city? Gentlemen. Dickens compares Mr. Grand Grain to which character of children's fairy tales? Bluebird. Bluebird. Where does Mr. Bounder be? says that he lived as a young man so the answer is in the gutter who pays stephens as unwelcome visit in the middle of the night so the answer is his drunk wife who arranges the marriage between louisa and mr bounderby mr grand grid and mr bounderby next question what does Louisa love more than anyone else? Her brother Tom Grandgain. Cocktown is like uh, to what fallen city of the Bible? The answer is Babel. What is the name used to describe Tom in the second half of the novel? Valve. Who is not an employee of Mr. Bounderby at the same point in the novel? The answer is Mr. Harthouse. What is the name of Slackbridge labor movement? United Aggregate Tribunal. Next question. Why does Stephen Blackpool refuse to join the labor movement? Answer is because of a promise to Rachel. When does Mrs. Sparsit move into Boundary's bank after Boundary is married? What is her house nickname? Jam. What is the Louisa's curious reserve? Her assistance to Mr. Harthaus advances. In how many books hard times is derived, divided? So in three books. Next question. Essays of Ilya are blank in nature. So none of the above. Satirical, autobiographical, none of the above. Who is called the Princess of English Essay? Prince of English Essay. Charles Lamb. Adonis is an alleged return on the death of kids. Who among the following is historical novelist? Walter Scott. Who said, I awoke one morning and found myself famous? Lord Byron. Our next question. Who wrote the confessions of an English opium eater? Thomas D. Quincy. Coldridge's distinctive between fancy and imagination occurs in his biography, Literature, chapter number. 13. Next question. A thing of beauty is joy forever. Which verse tale of kids begins with this line? Andy Milon. Kids la belle dame and mercy is ballad. Lord Byron died at the age of 36 years. What is the name of the fictitious landscape of Thomas Hardy's novel? Wessex. Who wrote Origin of Species? Charles Darwin. What is the real name of George Eliot? Mary Annie Evans. Mary Annie Evans. Most important question. He died of tuberculosis at the age of 25, but not before leaving an impressive body of poems, including the Autumn and Ode of Melancholy. So the answer is John Keats. Ilya is a pen name of Charles Lamb. The author perfected, perfected the historical novel, but she or he is always wanted to be known as a poet. 
सर वॉल्टर स्कॉट नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन यूनिट फोर लिरिकल बेलाड वो रॉट द लिरिकल बेलाड विलियम वर्ड्स वर्थ एंड एस्टिक कॉलेज वो रॉट द फेमस प्रीफेस टू लिरिकल बेलाड विलियम वर्ड्स वर्थ विलियम वर्ड्स वर्थ बोर्ड बोर्न इन सेवनटीन सेवनटी लिरिकल बेलाड्स विद अ फ्यू लाइन अ फ्यू अदर पोएम्स इज कलेक्शन ऑफ पोएम्स बाय विलियम वर्ड्स वर्थ एंड सैम्यूअल टेलर कॉलेज फर्स्ट पब्लिश इन सेवनटीन मोस्ट ऑफ द पोएम्स इन द सेवनटीन नाइन्टी एट एडिशन ऑफ लिरिकल बेलाड्स वर रिटर्न बाई वर्ड्स वर्थ नाइन्टी पोएम्स नाइनटीन पोएम्स विद कॉलरेज कंट्रीब्यूटिंग ओनली ब्लैंक पोएम्स फॉर पोएम्स वाई इज द इयर नाइन सेवनटीन नाइनटीन ईयर टेकन टू बी द बिगिनिंग ऑफ द रोमेंटिक मोमेंट बिकॉज इट वॉज द इयर इन विच द लिरिकल बेलाड्स वर वॉज पब्लिश्ड वर्ड्स वर्थ वॉज पॉपुलरली नॉन एज द पोएट ऑफ लेक डिस्ट्रिक्ट पिक अ पिक ओड वन आउट वॉल्टर स्कॉट आफ्टर वो वर्ड्स वर्थ बिकेम पोएट लिवरियट ऑफ इंग्लैंड रॉबर्ट साउथी नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन वर्ड्स वर्थ पोएट द प्रेड्यूट इज अटोबायोग्राफिकल पोएम स्टर्न डॉटर ऑफ अ वॉइस ऑफ गॉड हु इज दिस स्टर्न डॉटर ड्यूटी The lyrical ballads opens with the rhyme of ancient mariner. The lyrical ballad closes with lines written above Tintern Abbey. He prayeth best, who loveth best, all things great and small. In which poem do these lines occur? The rhyme of ancient mariner. Next question. Pride and Prejudice. Which novel by Jane Austen is bulk of the Gothic novel? Northanger. Abbey, which novel by Jane Austen is incomplete? Sandition, the novel Pride and Prejudice, originally entitled as First Impressions. Next question, Tristabel. Who wrote Water, Water Everywhere and All the Boards and Did Drink Water, Water Everywhere, Nor Any Drop to Drink? S. T. Coleridge. Coleridge is best known for his concept of imagination. In how many parts Christabel is divided? Four. The rhyme of ancient mariner. These are the MCQs related to acquaintances. Author S. T. Coleridge. Publication seventeen ninety eight from poetry and form say ballad. What does the mariner shoot in the rhyme of ancient mariner? Albatross means it is sea bird. The mariner in the, in the novel the rhyme of ancient mariner kills an albatross. Uh, in Coleridge's poem, the rhyme of ancient mariner, where were the three gallants going a wedding? Next, sense and sensibility. In which form Jane Austen's sense and sensibility written? The epistolary form, and it is written by Jane Austen. Next question, John Don John. Don John has sixteen cantos. Which work has Byron called epic satire? So Don John. Next question. Heroes and hero worship. Who wrote heroes and hero worship? Thomas Carlyle. What type of work is hero and hero worship? Collection of lectures. Vanity Fair. Which of the following novel is called novel without a hero? Vanity Fair. What is the subtitle of the Vanity Fair? A novel without hero. What does the term Vanity Fair come from? Bunyan's Pilgrim Progress. Next, David Copperfield. Which was Dickens' autobiographical novel? David Copperfield. Kenilworth. What kind of novel Kenilworth is historical romance? Next question. Who wrote Wuthering Heights? Emily Bronte. Wuthering Heights contains element of Gothic fiction. Great Expectations. What is the name of the central character in Dickens' Great Expectations? Pip. Unto this last. Who wrote Unto this last? John Ruskin. Jane Eyre, under which pseudonym Charlotte Bronte's Jane Eyre was published, Courier Bell. In how many volumes Jane Eyre was originally published? In three volumes. Okay, friends. So these are the most important MCQs. Will help you a lot in your examination. Okay, if you like this video, please hit the like button and subscribe our channel for many more updates of our next videos. Okay, bye bye.